Hey guys, welcome to Cash Out Friday. As every Friday, I'm gonna share with you guys my favorite products of the week and also a little bit of chit chat since this is more of an informal video that we have to keep in touch with each other. So if you're interested in knowing what those things are, then just keep watching this the video. The first thing that most of you have noticed is that I'm gonna try to upload Monday through Fridays and this is one of my very first goals when I started YouTube. The people that I connect the most even though we're not friends here in YouTube but youtubers that I follow are the ones that have a consistent uploading day and most of them or the ones that I watch the most are the ones that are even daily or every other day they have a video up I don't know what it is I don't know if I'm the only one that likes that kind of stuff but I think it would be interesting to give you a video a day and maybe you can watch it early in the morning before you go drop off the kids or maybe Maybe you want to wait and do a marathon on a Saturday I don't know but I will be uploading a video a day and I think that will keep us more connected and at the same time we can share all this beauty that we love here in YouTube. So the highlight of the week has been, um, I don't know if you remember, but on Wednesday, oh, by the way, I will be linking all the videos that uh, are gonna be before this casual Friday. So if you're watching this video on a Friday and you wanna check Monday's video or Tuesday video or whatever, you're gonna find all the links in the info box so you can go back and see whichever you want. But I think Wednesday I uploaded my most used um, makeup look using my Naked 2 palette and this girl that I really look up to because she's an amazing makeup artist. She has a big channel and she is really talented and honestly every time she uploads something it's like that's the video that I want to see because she has amazing techniques. She shows you exactly how to work your brushes. She is amazing. So um, her username and her channel will be linked down below. It's Glitter702 I believe but it will be linked in the description box. I think she's amazing. I I really really look up to her and she left me a comment saying how much she loved the tutorial. So coming from her and it's not that it's gonna give me popularity or whatever you know it's not about that but whenever you admire somebody that much as I do to her and you know I learned a lot of things from her as well uh, it really was the best compliment that I could get and it made my day it made my week and as I told her it made my year so really amazing totally the highlight of the week another thing uh, that I've been thinking about for a while now I want to do a vlog channel and um, I'm only 31 years old but I've gone through depression and I, I went through a lot of things that I thought that I couldn't get out of and things that really held me down and led me to think that it wasn't worth it you know keep working on that keep trying keep fighting for what I want so I feel the need to share with a lot of people things that happened to me and how I did overcome those things and what I did what worked what didn't work and if you're going through similar situations in your life or if you know somebody that is going through a similar situation in their lives I think that this would help them see some hope and I most definitely want to call it like uh, something about happiness because I truly believe that if we are always deciding to be happy no matter what situations come into our life no matter what the day throws at us we can make things better for ourselves and we have always the hope to make things better to at the end be happy so absolutely I want to do this channel I know that a lot of people it's going through the same things that I went through uh, obesity, depression, losing loved ones, and being a teen mom. There's a lot of things that people are going through right now and if I can give you my input and what I did to overcome those things. So um, you don't have to subscribe to that channel. I will let you know as soon as it's available. So if you're interested and go and check that out, that would be amazing. If not, we can continue our 
beauty thing here in my beauty channel. Then I've been watching some old videos from this girl. Uh, her YouTube name is Shades of Shades of Cassie, and she had a really good idea that I think she got from somebody else. I can't remember her name right now, but she got this idea from somebody else as well, which is my weekly uh, makeup basket. And you just grab a few products that you want to go through, maybe some stuff that you're almost done with, or some stuff that you're not using just because you have a favorite foundation, favorite concealer, and that's what usually what happens to me. Whenever I want to reach for a foundation, I go to my MAC one. Whenever I want to reach for the perfect concealer, I reach for my Pro Longwear, Pro Longwear concealer, but it's not like I don't know, like I'm giving other products a chance because that's the easy thing to use or that's the easy and safest thing to use. So I really want to use up the products that I have on my collection. If by the end of the week I don't end up loving them and, or I don't really care for them, I will be giving them away to a family member. If not, I'm gonna be tossing it if it is really bad. But I don't wanna really collect that much makeup that it's gonna go bad uh, on my drawer and nobody is really using it so that's one thing I don't know if I'm gonna be uploading on Saturday my weekly makeup basket or if I'm gonna do it um, maybe Mondays I'm not sure what I'm gonna do it but since starting next week I'm gonna start my weekly makeup basket and I'll show you all the products that I'm gonna be using and by the end of the week on my casual Friday we can decide if that's something that I'm gonna keep using or if it's something not worth it so the first thing is something for the nails. I'm not big in nails, but I love this thing. This is the e.l.f. Nail Polish Remover Pads. And it comes with 20, 24 pads. And it has some citrus scent. I don't know. I really can't tell. Mm, smells like, I don't know, polish remover, actually. But it says that it has citrus scent. Maybe it does, and I can't really pick it up. But it actually works two of these little toilettes work for all my nails and it actually removes my glitter nail polish so I've been loving them it leaves your nails condition um, and I've been using acetone for so so long that my nails get very very dry but since I started using this I think they're really inexpensive and worth so it. the next thing is my NYX BB cream and I have a first impression and a blog post about this BB cream it's the best thing ever I mean I love my BB cream it's amazing but it's about 34 or 38 dollars which is pretty ridiculous and this is the thing that I found that is the closest to that one it's amazing it not only covers just imperfections it fills your pores and then at the same time it gives you the most natural look it's not satin it's not dewy it's not matte it's natural look so it looks like you're not wearing any kind of makeup but at the same time you can really even out your skin tone and make it look so radiant and clean I don't know how to explain it but if you're in the market for a new BB cream I would absolutely recommend the new one from NYX so the next thing is some a hair product and I don't really talk about hair products that much because I don't use them that much but I've been loving this Tresemme split remedy and and I mentioned this before this is something that I had in my collection for a pretty long time because you use the tiniest amount it is some kind of cream that smells amazing it really smells amazing I just want to grab it and moisturize my skin with this I don't know it's amazing the smell but other than that it actually closes your split ends they, it doesn't do it hundred percent but it helps me keep my ends healthier so I don't have to trim them that often I do have a lot of hair and you know I usually have to trim it pretty often to keep it healthy looking but I love this to keep it clean in between cuts and like I mentioned before a little amount works amazing on my hair the thing is these 12 hours made to last eyeshadow pencil from Jordana and specifically in the color continuous almond uh, this is the color and it's a dupe at least the color for the matte paint pot in painterly the only thing is that this one doesn't last as long as the it doesn't last as long as the painterly paint pot but 
absolutely the same color and it prepares your lids for applying eyeshadow so I love this it's amazing and I've been using it a lot it also it is very dry it's not as creamy as the paint pot but that makes your one eyeshadow look last longer so if you decide to use just the pencil as um, your eyeshadow for the day it doesn't really crease on you so the next thing is a lip gloss and it's from Mary Kay and it's in the color pink parfait and uh, this is how it looks like it has a lot of pigmentation so, so you don't really have to apply it on top of a lipstick or anything like that it actually can stand by itself and even if you have very pigmented lips like mine you can still wear this by itself and it's an amazing color it's not like a Barbie pink it's not as neon or as bright as a Barbie pink but I think it's very flattering and if you're doing maybe a smoky eye this is a nat this is a nice addition to that and it won't take away from your eyes but at the same time it will pull the look together well girls that was it I hope you enjoyed my casual Friday uh, let me know if you have any comments about the news that about the channel the new channel the upload days whatever you want to talk about just leave it in the comments down below I would love to hear from you you know that I always reply to my messages sometimes it goes to a spam folder who knows why but uh, you know it takes me a minute to get to them but I absolutely will get to all of my messages or comments so thank you for watching once again I will see you in my next video on Monday have a good weekend Mwah.